time to play Name That Genre. From the box art, Mobile Light Force 2 looks like a Charlie's Angels knockoff. Nope. Well then, looking at the character screens, it must be one of those anime RPGs with 45-minute cutscenes. Again, no. In reality, Mobile Light Force 2 is a port of the Japanese arcade shooter. Note the vertical letterboxing. Really makes you feel like you're at the arcade. And really wastes a lot of screen space. Hmm, how can we put that space to good use? I know, dance party! As you can see, Mobile Light Force 2 is one of those insanely difficult games where you have to blast dozens of enemies while skillfully dodging hundreds of tiny projectiles. Or not. There's quite a bit of not dodging going on in this game. The enemies are decidedly, well, Japanese. Rampaging teddy bears, spinning dollies, and giant pulsating brains are only some of the weirdo foes you'll face. And what is this ugly thing? Nothing scarier than a giant butterfly with a baby face. Okay, enough dancing. I need to focus on the game. Did I mention that it's psychotically hard? How the heck am I supposed to dodge all that crap? Ah! Okay, I need a break. Let's look at those characters again. Each character comes with their very own incomprehensible biography. This guy is a retired cop who controlled a beautiful human eating demon. Hang it up! Back up! And over here we have a very special detective from the Wolf God bloodline. Then there's this poor girl who doesn't even get a name. Each character has their own style of combat, including some pretty devastating special attacks. Boy, for a chick with no name, she really kicks butt. Die, pulsating brain. Back to the little spermy things from whence you came. And for an extra dose of incomprehensibility, there's the dialogue. Your dog will suffer. Did cute guy just say, your dog will suffer? Your dog will suffer. Yep, that's what it sounds like. Ah, oh, forget it. I'm dying too much anyway. More dancing! Unless you're a masochist with the reflexes of a god, Mobile Light Force 2 is going to bring you nothing but frustration. Ah! Nothing more demeaning than getting your butt kicked by some Teddy Graham. And if you do have godlike reflexes, then you'll finish the game in about half an hour. Five short levels, and that's all she wrote. To its credit, the game only costs ten bucks. But that's at least, well, it's about ten bucks too much in my book. We give Mobile Light Force 2 an Angel's ripoff anime wannabe headache-inducing one out of five.